What's good you guys, it's Kay and welcome back to another video. So you guys, for today's video, I definitely just wanted to take you guys along. It is a Saturday. The date, I'm not quite sure of, but I'll definitely have it on the screen. But it is Saturday and this is usually like my chill day, reset day. So I definitely wanted to take you guys along for a little productivity vlog just so that you guys can see what that kind of looks like. We're definitely going to be resetting our space today. So yeah, the house definitely isn't like a mess or anything, but there are some areas that are just like questionable i definitely plan to do some like cleaning today i definitely plan to do some organizing because y'all when you see the closet when you see the closet yeah you're gonna be like girl what is this so yeah my closet is an absolute mess right now so i definitely wanted to do some like organizing i bought some things from amazon that would definitely help with just organizing the place and just making it just feel like walkable and breathable especially in the closet because yeah i feel like we haven't had that in such a long time so i definitely want to like kind of get it together um and just kind of like make space for us to be able to actually walk in our closet because you know that's the whole point so yeah i definitely just plan to do that today and if you guys like videos like this definitely be sure that you go ahead and subscribe down below and yeah we're just gonna go ahead and get into it just so that we can knock everything out and later on tonight we're just gonna chill so yeah that is the plan for this day but first i have to start with like washing some clothes because you know living with two people you accumulate clothes really really fast and honestly we don't even know how we be doing it sometimes because it's just two of us you know so we're like ugh, imagine when we really do like have kids and other people in the house as well like i just i just can't imagine how much laundry we're gonna have so yeah every single week we accumulate so much laundry so it's time to definitely go ahead and tackle that today so that's exactly what we're gonna do i'm gonna go ahead and just start on some laundry real quick and then we're gonna go ahead and get into organizing and cleaning the bathroom so yeah let's just go ahead and get on into it Alright y'all, so now the bathroom is done. Now it's time to tackle the closet, which honestly is the biggest project of the freaking day, okay? I'm gonna show you guys the closet. Do not judge, okay? Do not judge because it is crazy up in there. It seriously is crazy. But we gonna take down that mountain today. It's so much stuff in there and some of the stuff just honestly needs to go if we're being honest like I, it doesn't even need to be in this house like i'm not even gonna lie so yeah i need to figure out which stuff i'm keeping which stuff i'm putting away which stuff i might be giving away all that so yeah definitely about to show you guys the closet because it's it's honestly crazy so let's see what we can do in there see the transformation i'm excited though because this is like a long time coming so let's just go ahead and do it 
So y'all, this is what <laughs> the closet looks like. Oh my God, y'all. Like, it is a mess. Like, look at all those shoes over there. Like, they're just thrown over there. There's so many different, like, blankets. There's literally blankets all up here. Honestly, I don't know if I'm going to really do anything about the blankets that are up there. But, yeah, it's just time to get some organization in this closet. All the clothes are just crazy. All the hoodies are crazy. Like, I'm probably going to go ahead and redo this area. Like, it's just a lot. And then if y'all can see in here, like, even this area right here is a mess. Oh, my God, y'all. This closet is crazy. But, yeah, it's time. It's really time. Okay, y'all. So, I just threw pretty much everything out of the closet. <laughs> And this is what it is. Like, I need to throw some of this stuff away. Seriously, like, this stuff has to go. Like, a lot of this stuff is just in this closet for no reason. So, yeah, this is the what it's giving. I'm going to show you guys as I'm, like, cleaning out the closet, too. But, yeah, I just had to throw all this stuff out because I literally couldn't even get in the closet. <laughs> so, yeah. content and you know we just filmed some videos today too and yeah I had to chill out because that first part took me out but I'm gonna show you guys the progress I got all the little like um what do you call those things the little um air air compressed bags I got them all compressed and it honestly saves so much space if you guys are interested in getting like your hands on those or you want to know the ones that I got I'm gonna put them in my Amazon store so y'all can definitely click that link in my description and it's gonna be there because those actually just like saved our whole closet it just saves so much space because we have so many excess like comforters and pillows and just excess like uh blankets and stuff too so it really did save me so much space being able to just like put them up there. And I think I showed you guys the top like before. Um, so I'm going to show you guys the after because it really does look like so much better. So now all I have to do is like set up the shoe rack and then I'll probably spend tomorrow. So I'll take you guys. This is actually going to go into tomorrow because it's like nine o'clock, you guys. Like we're about to eat and, you know, make some dinner and just chill and relax. So I'll probably just finish this up tomorrow. Now I'm thinking about it. When tomorrow am I going to do this? In the morning? We'll figure it out. But yeah, so yeah, I'm probably going to finish this a little bit later and show you guys um, just the finished product so that you guys can see how the closet came out. But yeah, because we definitely have a lot to do. I have some clothes to fold and all that. But realistically, I just feel like it's not going to get done tonight. So yeah, I'll definitely like keep you guys in the loop of when I go ahead and do that too. Yeah, we're just about to go ahead and finish out this closet because I need these shoes organized. I cannot deal with this for another 
day okay and the closet's looking amazing it's already had so much progress and i'm just really really happy about it you know when you clean your space and you can just like feel like you can breathe a little bit more like that's how it feels so i'm definitely happy that i did just take on this project and decide to do it and then like i said even like the little bit of progress that we did make like it's just like we can actually walk into our closet which says a lot because for months now we haven't even been able to freaking open the door so yeah small wins baby steps you guys know the drill so yeah i'm about to show you guys the progress and then put together our little shoe thing that i got hopefully it looks good I don't really know how it's gonna turn out or like how big it is I really didn't I don't I really don't know you guys I hope it looks good I hope we can use it and I hope it just like fits all of our shoes and stuff but yeah we'll see and then I need to reorganize like the entire closet honestly again that's gonna be a project for a completely different day because yeah it's a lot but Again, if you like these type of videos, you guys, definitely let me know and I'll bring you more of them because there's always a project to do around the house, okay? I know if you if you know, you know, like you feel me. So yeah, let's go ahead and just get into it before we wind down and eat some dinner and call it a night. <laughs> All right, y'all. So this is the progress. This is what I meant when I said like literally we have so much more space up here now and then this is like what the bottom looks like of course we got to get these shoes together because that's still a mess but at least we can't open the freaking door like what that is like a win a win is a win but yeah and then behind the door i just have like a few storage things these are those like vacuum this is what the vacuum storage bags look like and then it came with a little pump which i thought was going to be harder to blow or not blow but suck I thought it was going to be harder to suck than it actually was and it was actually super easy so yeah um but these are like bags that i mean they have to be in here because there's nowhere else to put them and then like a suitcase and then we have a blow-up mattress we have some expo boards and then i hung tyron's picture that i got for him one year on his birthday i think i got this for his birthday um i just hung it up here just because you know it looks better than just like sitting on the floor you know so i just hung it up here and it's so cute and then this is his side of the like closet anyway so i thought it was cute um but yeah it looks so much better in here i can actually see the freaking floor which needs to be vacuumed but don't mind that um i can actually see the floor like what love that love it so yeah let's get these shoes together and yeah that's what we gonna do okay so this is cool they actually came with like little aromatherapy sticks so like i guess it makes the box smell good that's cool nice little touch all right this is a project Grand garages, presidential suite on deposit, elevator up to the room, shower up and then we hit the club, touchdown, gotta see what's up, area code in my phone, what numbers do I still have, who do I know from the past, hit one and she say she got a man, hit another one it goes green, must have changed foes on the team, remember when you let me in between, that was 2017, all good, chug a look around, find one to see my type, damn my dog and he know what I like, he done found me plenty in my life Problem is I meet a girl tonight Then I go and treat her too nice Gallery of credit card swipes I don't even know if she a wife And then but I don't know one thing, no. You're supposed to put the aromatherapy sticks in Sunday, Sunday, So let's see Maybe I'll love you one day Maybe we'll someday grow Till then I sit my drunk ass on that runway On this one way 2.30 baby won't you meet me by the now how am I supposed to get this open? Damn. That took a lot. I ain't gonna lie. Put the aromatherapy stick in. And then close it back. And we're good. One box down. A couple more to go. 
Jury in the safe on arrival, pistol on J for survival. A lot of people gunning for the title, a lot of people trying to take us viral. I'm just trying to have a nice night, the waiter brought a check for the meal. She said, babe, I think there was a typo. Nah, girl, I got it, that's life, though. I can show you bigger things than that. It's gonna be a minute till I'm back. Let me get your images that last. Amex had a limit in the past. I had plenty women in the past. I done plenty sinning in the past. Y'all don't need to know, but you can ask. Sticking on your backstage pass All access cause you bad You could go wherever with that ass Show to the shower, to the truck Truck to the club for the party You go in first with your girls Cause I don't know who's out there watching But I do know one thing though Women they come they go Saturday through Sunday, Monday, Monday, Sunday yo Maybe I'll love you one day Maybe we'll someday grow Till then I sit my drunk ass on that runway On this one way Thirty, baby, won't you meet me by the beam? Two, early, baby, later, you can show me things. So this is the final product of the shoe holder or shoe case, whatever you want to call it. I think it came out pretty good. I really like how it looks. It looks a lot more clean than it did before. That's for sure. So yeah, I'm kind of like feeling it. It definitely has to grow on me a little bit, but it's definitely very organized. So yeah, this is what we're working with now. And I really do like it. I really do like it. So yep, we're done with that. All right, y'all, so that is gonna be wrapping up this week's vlog. I didn't actually finish like the full closet, so y'all stay tuned for when that's done. Like I said, I definitely need to go in and like just like reorganize the way that the clothes are hanging, reorganize the way that they're folded up and stuff like that. So there's just still so much work in there to do, but I am just sitting here editing now and I realized that I didn't even close out today's video and I kind of just want to chat to you guys and honestly just like you know just say kind of some things that have been on my mind because yeah I've been meaning to talk to you guys and just really just honestly just vent I feel like this is like my safe place is still very small we are still very very small but I definitely feel like this is like my safe place so I definitely just wanted to just like vent to you guys because yeah I mean I'm not gonna lie y'all it has been so tough like of an adjustment so I'll say for like the month of August because now currently it is September 1st and so yeah as you guys know i've kind of talked about it on my channel before i did recently start a new position august was like my first full month and i was just like it was just like a lot to adjust to if that makes sense like you know with okay because let me let me give you guys let me back up let me give y'all a little backstory all right so so i basically kind of transitioned out of real estate towards the end of like june i think i want to say towards the end of june regardless i had a little gap in between when i started this role and then when i was doing like real estate and so like during that like what two to three week span i was really able to like get a taste of like what it would feel to be like full-time content and just like making my content pouring into myself like you know just things like that just being on my own time and really just like digging into content creation and it honestly gave me a taste of you know really just where i want to go just in life and you know where i want to take my content so i think just like going off of that and then starting this role in july obviously not having like a whole bunch of time for myself or to create content was definitely like a really big switch and i think i've just been going through a lot of big changes this year so yeah august was definitely like an adjustment month but i'm not gonna say it was bad because it wasn't bad i'm so grateful to like be in a position where i finally have stability in my life i don't know if i kind of mentioned that to you guys before yet but yeah i'm definitely grateful to be in a position where i have some more stability but at the same time it's just making me want to go harder with content so yeah it was definitely just like a little difficult trying to figure out my groove and like how i wanted to work content into my schedule so now september is here it went by so fast but also it, it went by so slow at the same time it's very weird but yeah so now i feel like september is here and i'm just being really intentional about what i want to do in terms of like content in terms of like you know just building my like self and i think like sometimes when you do have like a job or like a nine to five or just like a tr traditional role 
it can be easy to like lose yourself because I definitely am seeing it like when you're on like a schedule where you have to be somewhere at a certain time it can be very tiring like it can be extremely tiring to the point where you know it's technically my weekend it's Friday but I don't work on Friday so I'm I, I'm like tired like by the by the time the week is over I'm tired by the time my shift is over I'm tired like you know what I mean so it can be easy and I definitely see how like a lot of people like kind of lose sight of like what they want to do in life or their dreams or you know their goals because it is hard it's very difficult to like stay motivated and to stay like inspired and to not feel like you just want to kind of re relax and rest on the days that you have off but honestly if anything this is like teaching me a really big lesson on just like consistency and really just like showing me like how bad do you really want it you know like i feel like that's what this period is really just trying to tell me so i'm like you know what god i want it real bad and i was like i want it really really bad and I'm honestly willing to do whatever it takes to kind of just like push through this season and, you know, be able to kind of make ends meet and, you know, provide for myself and kind of just like get on my two feet in terms of like being stable in life financially and then also like working towards and like pushing towards something bigger. So, yeah. I really just thought I would just take this time to really just like kind of video diary for myself, for you guys, so that you guys can just see like the growth and progression by this time next year, hopefully, not even hopefully, we're gonna claim it. By this time next year, things will be so different and I am claiming that in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus, I am claiming that over just my life and I'm claiming that over all of you guys too. Like. If you're going through something or if you're in a situation that isn't like truly where you want to be or and not even just that, but if you just want more for yourself, like I'm claiming that over the next 365 days, September 1st, 2024, your life is going to look so much different. And, you know, it really does start with what you're doing every single day. And I think that that's like the main thing that I want to focus in on, like at this point in my life is like, OK, making sure that I'm making the most out of each day. So that, you know, next year rolls around and there's actually change. You know, it's not enough to want change. You know, it's not enough to have or set goals. Like, you actually have to get up every single day and, like, work towards them. And excuses are real. You know, the things that you're excusing yourself because of, like, you know, they're really happening. But it doesn't make them worth it, if that makes sense. Like, it doesn't make them valid. It doesn't make them... Um, worth your goal or your dream you know and I feel like that's really just where I am and I feel like my whole mindset is just like expanding a lot in this season and I'm grateful for it and yeah I just want to get in the habit and used to like talking to you guys and like venting and kind of like you know just being super raw and super real on this channel too because again I do feel like this is my safe space and I re really want to build a community where we can definitely like share stories like we can be vulnerable with each other you know and like just real because at the end of the day like life isn't just all peaches and rainbows and happiness and you know like life is real you know so i really just want to keep it so real on this channel just be me just like say how i feel also so that i can go back and like look at these videos and be like damn like you know kind of inspire myself just by like my own journey and just like everything that i've been through so yeah i'm feeling good you guys i'm feeling like i was tired today like to the point where i had to literally go get a red bull to finish editing this video so that it could be up before like like sunday so yeah that's definitely just what's been on my mind but again my goal is just to be super consistent with youtube with tiktok and then again that is another thing that i've kind of just like i've been really just like aligning my focus and i think setting my priorities and i think that's like the biggest thing because especially with content when you're trying to post on like so many different platforms instagram tiktok youtube like wherever else it can be like so much sometimes so i think it's just like kind of like narrowing down my focus has helped a lot like in my mind um so yeah y'all will be seeing a lot of different content from me and yeah my goal is just consistency the season of life is called consistency so yeah but with that being said you guys we're gonna go ahead and wrap today's video i'm gonna finish editing tonight actually one of our friends is kind of like having a little 
labor day outing i guess you can say we're gonna go out to the club so so yeah with that being said you guys i will go ahead and wrap up here hopefully you enjoyed today's video if you did definitely go ahead and make sure to subscribe down below leave a like leave a comment show some love and i will see you guys in my next video